the actual name of the presentation is Antecedents and Motivation Factors of Participating in Virtual Communities. Um, so, go ahead, please. Hello, you all. My name is Julius. Uh, I'm here with the Devin and Fabio. We are doing a research about the participating factors, uh, motivating factors in virtual communities. Uh, it means what motivates users to participate actively in virtual communities. Now you're done, we'll give you some definitions about the, the research. Since we have, we are having problem with the slides here. Okay. Okay, now you're done, we're gonna talk about the definitions about the virtual communities and motivation. Okay, you're done. So what motivated us to run this research is that it is that lots of research is about motivation uh, or better. Uh, factors and mechanisms for motivation for active participation on several different types of virtual communities. For example, wikis, social networks, and crowdsourcing platforms. And another motivation to do this research is because Malone and others <coughs> cited that understanding why people participate on collective intelligence systems is one of the most important things to consider when building such systems, like uh, virtual communities that is the object of our study. So the main objective of our research is to comprehend the factors and mechanisms that motivates users to actively participate on a virtual community. And to reach this main objective, we have three more specific objectives. First, to find the factors and mechanisms from the literature. And second, to implement these mechanisms on a new virtual community focused on creation and validation of business ideas. And finally, to verify the efficiency of the mechanisms that we implemented on this new virtual community. So before I start talking about our methodology, we have to show some definitions that we use on our entire presentation. First, what are virtual communities? By definition, virtual communities are social networks where people with similar interests, objectives, <coughs> or practices interact to share knowledge, information, and engage into social interaction. And another important definition is what are the motivating factors and mechanisms and what is the difference between them? So the factors are what's, what drives an active behavior on a virtual community. And the mechanisms are a physical realization, a physical implementation of a factor. So the mechanisms could be characteristics, functionalities, or managerial aspects of a virtual community. And because that, they tend to be more concrete instead abstract like the motivating factors are. And now, Flavio will talk a bit, uh, more about our methodology. Okay, now we talk a little about our methodology. Uh, it is a systematic literature review based on guidelines for Harvard Business. The Harvard Business proposal is presented in the following part. Uh, there are three types uh, defined by her. Plan, everything, and support. Plan is just uh, everything, uh, the definition of the protocol and the process. Execute is the first protocol execution, and report is to show the results of um, the protocol. Um, after that, we will define the same specific protocol to use the <coughs> uh, We have, uh, first we have the objectives, and then we have the questions. And as you can see, questions and objectives look like the same thing. They are almost the same thing. The objectives, the objectives to define the factors and mechanisms that uh, motivate uh, users to, part uh, to participate 
shape and then what do you And question is, what are these vectors and sequences? They are just like the same thing. And we also uh, define a database to search for our discuss uh, articles. So we do our search. The database uh, uses a search for introduction class. And the searcher terms uh, were motivation and people's needs. And we use the article search and that kind of thing. And we also have uh, two criteria. Uh, inclusion and exclusion criteria. Inclusion criteria uh, is when the title, the subject, or the summary in an article uh, shows that the purpose that the article uh, addresses uh, factors and mechanisms that motivate the user to actively participate in a resulting way. And the exclusion criteria is when the summary addresses uh, factors and mechanisms and influences related to other types of platforms that are not uh, resulting in VC uh, and means resulting in. Okay, and we have now finally uh, that the information sequences have two steps. So, first, to aggregate motivating factors at two levels and then uh, synthesize information. And finally, to associate the motivation, uh, motivation factors with the corresponding uh, mechanisms, if any. Uh, not all factors have a corresponding mechanism, and not all mechanisms uh, have a corresponding factors. Now, I'm going to talk you all a little about uh, a project and our results. Sorry, Okay, so. Our cell protocol, we found 2,100 uh, 2, uh, <coughs> articles, and then we selected by the criteria uh, 66, and we extracted data from 37 because this that uh, the other does not contain uh, data. Uh, they don't talk about the motivating factors in virtual community. Um, of a total of 19 motivating factors. We group it, five most cited uh, factors by similarity. They are specific learning, extrinsic motivation, external self-concept, and personal needs. Now I'm going to talk uh, and explain a little bit more about the, uh, each of these factors here. So the first one is the specificity, <coughs> is when users share information uh, to return favors that uh, he received from the others in an action of pay to the next. And I can give you an example of uh, software development forums when advanced users uh, help uh, beginners uh, software developers with questions about programming because they got help in the past. So it's an example of reciprocity. Uh, what motivates, motivates the users to do that is pay to the next. The second factor is learning. Is when the user is interested in taking information about some topic and he and I can uh, talk about another example, uh, a poker forum, for example. People share about uh, strategies, hands they play during some tournament because they want to get the other users' opinions about what they are doing to improve their knowledge and uh, skills as a, a player. Uh, the third factor is the explicit motivation when the user. Uh, is motivated to participate actively from a virtual community uh, because of some goal or objective uh, uh, explicit. For example, in the Yahoo Answers, it's a Q&A system. Uh, they have uh, a score for you when your when your answer got more likes or got the the, the best answer. You get a higher score, and it allows you to answer more, uh, ask more questions and answer more questions. So they are uh, goal-oriented users. And another factor is external self-concept. Is when people are motivated to take actions to that bring positive feedback, and it's the most easy example to explain because it's that's why people use Instagram or Facebook. They basically share information because they want to get likes in their pictures. Things like that, you know. And the last factor, <coughs> the, 
describe most cycles in the articles is the personal things. When users intentionally uh, share information uh, because they are trying to get something from that information. I will give another best example. Uh, it's when user answers a question and in the end of the answer, uh, he promotes uh, his company or business or some service. So he is expecting to generate leads for his business with that kind of tactic. So it's a personal gain kind of tactic. Uh, the next step of our research, uh, and it's current, currently being doing, is to implement a virtual community based, it's already online, uh, a virtual community based on, with the objective of uh, validating and discussing business ideas. So it's nanimakers.com.br, the website is important, <coughs> but basically here you can post some business ideas, some product idea. Or some current startup, you can set the uh, current status of your project, and then we have uh, an area that people can discuss about your project, give you feedbacks, and uh, here it's an environment that people can hire investors or collaborators or maybe contact clients. Okay, any questions? <coughs> questions? Oh, I have to say, one of the interesting things about this project is that they are already implementing it, uh, uh, and uh, this motivation, you, you, you probably noticed that it's an issue in many of the, the works that are, do, are being done here, because if we don't get people motivated to help us in these collective projects, they won't work, right? So this is their, their concern at this moment, and they, they're now trying to, to apply all the concepts related to yeah. motivation to this platform that they're building there. Uh, please visit afterwards. Yeah. One of the final uh, objectives of our project is to test the efficiency and the uh, effectiveness of these uh, tactics. Mm -hmm. That's the reason why we built a virtual community. Can you explicitly show uh, your factors and methods in your web, uh, platform now? Now, uh, <laughs> I think you're online. Yes, 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 you're online. Yes, you're online. Let me try it. As personal gains, uh, one example is the taxes work. I have to improve my business and then I will participate. <laughs> personal gains work. Okay. For example, we haven't implemented all the motivation okay, factors on it, but just, there is some, just some, of, of, the, the some of the factors. Yeah. For example, you, you are starting a new business, so you can go there, enter, uh, post about your business. And then you have a page like this, when you can, when you can, oh, it's not a good content, let me select another. You can just register your project here, and then you have a, a page like a mini page. And here you have a comments here that people can give you. <coughs> it's actually in a very early stage of this project, we are uh, setting the factors we implement, but uh, for personal gains, for example, you can use this area to generate backlinks to your website or just to have a page that shows your company, your service, your business, or whatever to the others. Okay, for don't this. forget to text us when you implement your platform. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Well, I mean, that, that's the reason why we studied all those factors for yeah. six months, right? <laughs> for the external self concept, we have a voting system. Yeah, it's kind of a like system here and on the, the project listing here. Okay, so we have to implement several other things, but we have uh, two more months to do this, huh? Mm -hmm. So now you have to solve how to make people to yes. use it, to motivate exactly. people to exactly. use it. We, we have to get the factors and implement mechanism, mechanisms that in that platform. Yeah, and hopefully the, those factors will be effective in their own research. Yeah. Okay. okay. Any more questions? Okay. Are you integration some social network? Yeah. Facebook. Uh, actually, we are using Chrome to make the loading system. So people cannot register, they just click anything else with Facebook, Google, or LinkedIn. And 
then we get data from there to a phone base, social networks, and make the two of the file. CPR. Yeah, go on. Well, the CPR is the message detector review of the song. Mm -hmm. uh, can you share it with me? Because mm -hmm. I, uh, I can use yeah, it. Yeah, sure. Uh, sure. Because uh, I, I am doing a uh, research only about motivation in the mobile web search, so I can use it. And one, one thing that we, we can start doing, you know, like a, a, a seminar like this one, is already something that you can refer to. So you can refer to their work, although it hasn't been published elsewhere, you can already say, well, it was a paper presented at Mostra de, de, Mostra de Pós-Graduação e Pesquisa. Is that how we call it? Uh, yeah. Yes, okay. Uh, and then we, we can already start citing each other's mm. work which is a good way of getting other people to know uh, about what you're doing. Fernando also has a question, but be before he, he, he asks it, one, one interesting thing is, notice, when they said, we are already implementing, then everyone said, wow, so this is good. <laughs> we get all excited about the implementation part of it. So for those of you who, who have been collecting information and understanding a problem, notice implementing is the next very interesting step that we have to take. Okay, Fernando. Is this going to just to do search? Or is to make money or a new business for you? And now it's just for the search, but if we if we reach a good result, maybe we can see about legal questions of turning it in a fictional project. But the, the first intention is not to make a business out of this, it's just to do a research to test to have an environment to test the motivating factors and how we we have been to that for six months. Any questions? Okay, thank you very much, guys.